Don't be. Oh, shut up, shut up. Oh, is it recording? Dude, shut up. Oh, I'm so sorry, I'm recording. Hold on, I'm getting started. I'm recording. Hold on. Hold on, I can't find it. Hey. Oh, shit. Oh, why'd you oh, drop a controller? Dude, stupid. Oh, I didn't need it. I'm sorry. I'm dude, sorry. Dude, oh, oh my god. god. Shut up. Here, I'm recording. What? Dude, dude. oh my god. Fuck. Oh, Pick it up. Man. Shut up. Just shut up. Just shut up. Hold on. Shh. Keep it still. Yeah, Keep yeah. it still. Of course, you'll need an Xbox 360. Second, you need the uh, AV cables that came with the console. Next, you'll need three Y AV splitters. You can see it has an input and an output, two outputs. Next, you will need a composite cable for five to ten dollars. You can get them anywhere. Next, you'll need the Dazzler, so you can plug AV cables into it, $70 to $100, or you can get the regular one for $40 and $50. You can buy the set Circuit City, or Best Buy, and you'll need the three CDs that come with it. And of course, you'll need a laptop or a computer. Okay, now, you take one of your Y AV splitters and you plug them into the left audio. See, there's two outputs. You plug one into the right audio. There's four outputs now. Plug one into the video. Let's get that in. You have six outputs. Easy. Really easy. Okay, now that you got those plugged in, it's time to insert your console AV cables. Alright. You have to match them up with the AV the white splitter that you put into the slot. See? This one's white. So you have to plug see white. You have to plug the left audio, which is the white cable, from your Xbox to that Y A V splitter. One of them. It doesn't matter if you choose the second one or the first one. Now you go to the red one, red audio, and plug it into one of the slots, not to the same one as the white, because that's very important not to plug it into the same one. Well, so one of them, see. and then the next one, the last one, audio, I mean video, video, yeah, plug into one of the slots, doesn't matter, yeah, now you'll see that you plug your Xbox cables in, see, now on to the second step. Once you plug in your Xbox cables, it's time to plug in those composite cables. It's like the Xbox, you plug the same color into the same Y splitter. And the same Xbox cable, so white to white. See? They're both the same Y, same AV Y splitter. Okay, the next one, the red slot, plug the red composite cable into it. Into the one Y AV splitter. See, see, matching. And last one, the Y, the yellow cable, the, the video matches with the Xbox video. Plug that into the same Y splitter. And see, now you're connected. Okay, the three CDs that came with your Dazzle. See, comes with the Dazzle. Yeah. You're only, you're only gonna need the yellow disc. Which is very important, which is like the Pinnacle Quick Start Studio version 10. That's where you can edit your videos and everything. Yeah, you can also capture, or you can use Windows Movie Maker. And when you do that, you take the yellow CD and then you install it to your computer or your laptop. Very simple. It might take a while though, it might 10 minutes probably. Okay, once that yellow disc is installed into your computer, let's see. Alright, let's kick, take a look at the, the Dazzle. Okay. Right, you can see there's, you can plug AV cables into it. Let's see. Okay, now you take the end of the composite cable that you plugged in with your Xbox. 
okay. A vision. Go back. Go back to the white one. Go the red one into the red slot. And then plug the last one, the yellow one, to its slot. Okay, hold on. Alright, yeah. Yeah. See? Hold on. See, now you can see it's plugged in. So, get the same signal from the TV, from the Xbox, so you can record from the computer. Right. At the end of the dazzle, there's a USB port on that table. use USB port at the end of it which you can plug into your computer. Once you install the yellow disc, this window should pop out and should lead you to three options. You should choose the Pin Pinnacle Studio Quick Start. It takes a while to kind of load so you gotta give it some time. Let's see. Pinnacle Studio Quick Start. Yellow disc. Once it is loaded, this screen should pop out. Okay, what you do is go to capture on the upper left corner. Just turn the load. Okay, now you can see the start capture. And if you turn your Xbox on, you should be able to see the image in the TV. See, I'm playing Guitar Hero. It's a solo in the beginning. See? That means you've done it right. See, on the TV. and on the computer. Very simple. Now if you want to start recording, there's a little button at the bottom it's called Start Capture. And there's like different qualities too, so I, I recommend you play with that. So when you press Start Capture, you name whatever your clip or video is. I'll name it that, whatever. And then when you press Start Capture, it's going to start recording, so you better play when it starts capturing. See? It captures, it takes on the load, so when it starts capturing, and then there's a button called stop capture, when, whenever you want to stop, so, yeah, it's that simple, see, I want to stop it, start again, it loads it, and then now you can edit, put it into your timeline, well, that's all to it, that, this is X Emo Sushi Boy, and now I've just shown you how to record your video games. Well, I hope this helped everyone, and if you have any questions, leave a comment below. Okay? Hope I see you on Xbox Live. Adios.